Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Trenton and Heightstown is brought to you by Princeton Orthopedic Associates. Better fix another plate, Mom. It's a full house for the Central Group 4 semifinals at Heightstown High School. Seven seed Trenton making the short trip to take on the third seed Rams. Heightstown coming into this one with their ace Colonial Valley Conference Player of the Year, Jamal Anderson. But this was Trenton's day. Captain Jair Brown off the rebound, helping the Tornadoes jump out to an 8 0 lead with 5.13 to play in the first. A few moments later, Brown back at it. This time it's the reverse to put Trenton up 13 2 with 4.03 to go in the opening quarter. And they weren't afraid to put in the work. Jordan Williams with the block is going to come up with it on the ground, flips it to Reggie James, and Jockey Alfred will finish this one off to give the Tornadoes an 18 7 lead at the end of the first. Second quarter, Nikas Jackson stops by the bank for two as Trenton is ahead 24-11 in the opening minute. You gotta love a guy on your team who's six foot six. Nikas Jackson bodying people for the putback. Count it and one. Tornadoes feeling the hype as it's 31-11 after the three-point play with 5.06 to play in the half. A few moments later, Reggie James gonna link up with Jair Brown for another easy two as they have a 19-point lead with 2.48 to play in the second. And if you're wondering how they've maintained that lead, ask Reggie James. You'll have a better chance of walking through TSA with a water bottle. Not happening. At the end of two, Trenton leads Heightstown 38 to 20. Coming out of halftime, Tornado's making it rain. Jordan Williams buries the long two to put them up 42-24 with 532 to play in the third. And better put out an advisory for Nikas Jackson. Gets his own rebound and converts it for another three-point play. These weather jokes working. Trenton leads Heightstown 46-28 with 3-11 remaining in the third. Sergi fellas are trying to spark the Rams. Lays it in as Heightstown trails by 19 in the closing minute of the quarter but you'll need to stop Reggie James if you want to have a comeback. James showing off the left gets it to fall, and the prep school transfer makes it 53-34 at the end of three. He wasn't done. Reggie James saving Jair Brown's pass, going to drive it to the rim, and the Tornadoes are out in front 61-39 with 5.48 remaining in regulation. As mentioned before, this was much more than a great offensive performance. Jair Brown serving up some homemade stuffing in crunch time, and if looks could kill, that stare down after the block, though. Brown would get a technical foul, but what's even crazier is a few plays later, a fan threw a bottle at one of the refs, and the official said they won't continue the game until every fan exits the gym. This wasn't a dream. It really happened. Fans warned earlier in the game for the same thing, and the conclusion of this one will have to look like a pickup game. No worries, Stripes return after a lengthy delay. Trenton cheerleaders don't mind, they get some more room to work. So we're ready to get back to action with four minutes to play. Tornadoes would hold the ball for most of that time. In the closing minute, Nikas Jackson comes up with the board, flips it to Jair Brown, and he'll make it 68-50. Then with seconds remaining, Nikas Jackson gets fouled, and he can wrap this one up at the free throw line. 70-56 is your final from Heightstown. 7 seed Trenton with a dominating performance from start to finish over 3rd seed Heightstown. Whoever did that seeding must have got their wires crossed. Jair Brown with 18 points, 12 rebounds, 7 steals, and 2 assists. Reggie James with 19 points, 7 rebounds, 3 steals. And Nikas Jackson 20 points and 14 rebounds in the victory. Tornadoes advancing to the Central Group 4 final where they will face number 1 seed Colts neck. After this performance, kind of hard to count them out. You can catch that action on March 5th. I'm Nery Rodriguez, and you already know, it's Jersey Sports Zone. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.